everyone. It's Bonnie. Happy windy Saturday. Oh my goodness. It is terrible outside. It's rainy. It's windy and it's feeling um, a lot like fall. I kind of miss summer. Can I say that? Everyone's going, no, Bonnie, don't say it. I miss the summer weather. I like it when it's light out at eight o'clock. I'm not liking this darkness. So anyway, um, it is what it is. It is getting dark early and Christmas is coming. So we are going to talk about Golden Berry Mistletoe. This is a brand new fragrance this year for Christmas, and it's in the new faceted holiday packaging. This is actually um, the Winter Candy Apple. It's, it's really pretty. I gotta say, I like the matching red lid. I like the sparkles. It's pretty. And then um, Vanilla Bean Noel. This is gonna be what um, the cream looks like. I actually like Vanilla Bean Noel this year. I feel like it's a lot stronger than last year. We'll see though. There's, there's a lot of pieces of Vanilla Bean Noel and um, the verdict's still out on that one. But um, Golden Berry Mistletoe is a little bit unusual. So I'm gonna go over the scent notes in this one. I actually have them on my phone. Uh, the scent notes in this one are sparkling berries, sugared spruce, and frosted air. So it's like, what is sugared spruce? <laughs> is it like a pine cone that they put sugar on? And sparkling berries, that's, that's pretty easy. Um, sugared spruce is kind of a difficult scent. To me, it almost smells like a pine cone with sap on it. That's what I'm going for. And maybe that's where they get the sugared spruce. So I have a ton of pine trees all over my house, in my house, like outside my house <laughs> and my driveway. I always have to be careful in the fall because like when the pine cones start falling, um, I tend to like trip on them and you don't want to like roll your ankle. So I always get, I always get the sticky hands, you know, in um, uh, Chevy Chase and National Lampoon's uh, European, um, uh, National Lampoon's, um, what's that one called? European, no, it's not European, European Vacation. <laughs> I'm getting all the Jimmy Chase movies mixed up. Uh, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. That's the one I'm looking for. <laughs> I haven't seen that like in a year. I watch it every year. Uh, but remember when Chevy Chase gets the um, pine cone sap on his fingers and uh, he gets it all over and he's trying to turn the pages? That's what I feel like. Uh, long story for a not very interesting <laughs> conclusion. Anyway, that's what this smells like. Um, and I don't know if I like it. I used it in the shower like once. It kind of <laughs> smells like you're showering in a pine forest <laughs> and you got a little bit too much sap all over which is kind of triggery and weird because sap is sticky and um, you can't wash it off <laughs> so I'm not sure I totally love this set I'm not sure where they got the mistletoe part of it uh what was the third note <laughs> I'm all over the place with this one uh, frosted air I'm not really getting any frosted air in this one there's no uh wintry note it doesn't smell like um, Sleigh Ride and Snuggles, or Snuggles and Sleigh Ride, whatever that one was. Um, it's not smelling like anything I've smelled before at Bath and Body Works. It smells, it smells like berries and tree sap. Like a little pine in there, but it smells like the sap part of it. And then um, I'm not getting any frosted air. So I don't know if I'm gonna love this, as a mist. This to me was a very odd choice for Christmas because there's so many other things they could have given us. I actually wanted a pine set. It's probably my fault because I was begging for a pine set, but I really wanted um, a nice like pine tree or actually, where's my Christmas candles? Um, the like, oh, where's the other one? Actually even fresh balsam, I think I would have preferred. I really wanted just a nice pine note in body care. I didn't want sap. Sap is definitely a little on the strange side in a body care. And you add the berry in there and it just it's just odd. I, I, I don't know, the verdict's still out. Like I said, I used it in the shower and I'm like, I'm showering in a pine forest and there's a lot of sap around and there's some berries. 
there's no Arctic air. So I think I would have rather have had, because this is in the same collection as um, Winter Candy Apple, Vanilla Bean Noel, and Twisted Peppermint, which I love all three of those. But this one just doesn't fit. Um, I would have put Bright Lemon Snowdrop in, wouldn't that have been enough? That would have been nice. If we had like a yellow or gold with Bright Lemon Snowdrop, here's the other thing. I think this is supposed to be gold, only it's not gold. It kind of looks like puce. It's not a pretty color. It's just kind of like mustard clear yellow. It's not pretty. Um, the other ones are gorgeous. So I think I would have picked Bright Lemon Snowdrop in a nice like bright um, like yellow packaging. That would have been nice. Um, any sort of plum in the purple would have been nice, like in the faceted. And that would have gone well with the whole collection. Or um, Santa's Blueberry Shortbread would have also been nice. Uh, and it could have been a blue one. It just wouldn't that have looked nice in this collection with the blue, the pink, the red? That would have worked too. So pink, a yellow, um, or a purple, or that blue, yellow, or purple would have been a good addition to pink, green, and red. <laughs> All those Christmas colors. I think this doesn't work as orange, but um, this really doesn't work for me. I don't know. I, the, the verdict's still out. Um, a lot of times with the shower gel, you get a lot more of the berry note in there. So maybe, just maybe, if the berry note's not quite as overwhelming, I might like it in the mist. But so far, um, I really wanted to like this. I started to like it. Like, I kind of went, I think I like it. Then I'm like, no, I don't think I like it. I don't know. We'll have to see when everyone gets it, what they think. But this was an odd... Um, an odd selection to me. Uh, the Jolly Village, what is it? Village Jolly, Jolly Village Gingerbread. Oh my gosh, I got these backwards, you guys. There's too many scents. Um, I'm excited about the gingerbread one. Because I usually always like gingerbread. So we'll have to see. But anyway, um, kind of interesting. Let me know if you got your hands on this one early and what you think. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.